Hiya! This video is going to be a bit different. We are outside the office for an upgrade project. This here is my parents' current house, and, well, it's pretty big. I mean, it's a good thing. It's a big house. My dad's worked his butt off throughout his career, and they live in a very comfortable place. The problem, though, is that since it is so large, about 5,600 square feet or so, they have issues with Wi-Fi connectivity. You know, you were talking about, you know, being way over here versus way up top there, or way in the back of the house, because it goes back a good ways. There's a lot that could go wrong in terms of your Wi-Fi connection. It's gotten so bad that my dad's put nine different access points in this house. That is insane. I have two. My house is, yeah, it's a, it's a decent size, but two access points is all I need. He has nine, and he's still complaining about connectivity issues. If I told him, we have one simple solution. And that is this guy right here. This is the ROG Rapture GT AXC 16000 and she's a behemoth. So what we're gonna do in this video is overhaul his entire Wi-Fi setup. We're gonna replace all nine of those access points with this one beastly router from ASUS. We wanna appreciate them for supporting us and for sponsoring this video. Hopefully you guys find this useful and hopefully we can fix my dad's internet. Are you ready? Stay with me. To get rid of that annoying Windows activation watermark, head on over to VIP SCD key and purchase a Windows 10 Pro OEM key for a fraction of the price of retail. Just use a secure payment method like PayPal, enter your product key into your PC settings window, and say bye bye to the watermark. And be sure to use our offer code SKGS for a so sweet discount. So let's kick things off by running through all the different access points in this house. And like I said, there are a lot of them. This here is his first, and it's hooked up to his modem. His ISP is Spectrum. Here's number two, number three, number four, number five, number six. I'm not sure why this one's on the floor, but whatever. Number seven. What's up, Kyle? <laughs> Numero ocho. And number nine. So yeah, this house is filled with them, but as you'll see shortly, the speeds are kind of sketchy, inconsistent, and honestly, not very fast a lot of the time. So here's a quick example. I'm in Kyle's room. He complains all the time while we're playing PUBG and COD that his internet is kind of crappy. He's not wired in. There are no wired connections in this house, so they have to use the Wi-Fi, and that's why it's so important that they have good Wi-Fi. So here's a speed test, and uh, we're just going to see how it does. Theoretical maxes here are about 500 megabits per second uh, download, and then I think upload, they're on coax, so it's like 50 or something below that. What is that? That's... It, it's okay. It's you can see though it's it's not really that great. And then uploads, yeah, they're just trash to begin with. That's their ISP's fault. So yeah, we're um we're not working with too much up here. Hopefully, replacing all these access points with a single super strong Wi-Fi 6 E capable ASUS router fixes their problems. And I have a pretty good feeling that it will. Hey Kyle, how bad your Wi-Fi? It's all right. I mean, if you want to drive like a, a Prius, like it's. Worse gas mileage than a TRX truck. So yeah, the reviews are in. She ain't that great. Let's see what ASUS can offer us. So the AXE 16000 is a quad band Wi-Fi 6E compatible router. It's capable of up to 16,000 megabits per second of data transfer. This six gig band is the latest band. It provides much faster speeds and reduced latency. That's good all around. It is a built-in 64-bit quad core, two gigahertz processor. That's beefy in and of itself capable of whole home mesh Wi-Fi, and it even has ASUS or RGB built in. And would you look at that, two 10 gig ethernet ports built into this thing. And this is like super overkill for what my dad has going on in his home, but it's super future proof at the same time. You'll probably never need to upgrade for a home solution. Now let's see what's inside. So this router is enormous. Look at the sheer size, it's larger than my hand. Oh my God, and there's so many antennae that protrude from this thing, I gotta say. It looks really good as far as routers go. Oh, would you look at this? Graced with some sweet, sweet peel. All right. So real quick, here are your ports. You've got a DC in, a power switch, USB 2.0 port, and a USB 3.0 port. A little reset switch in there, four LAN ports, one WAN port, and your two mighty 10 gig ethernet ports. And most of you know by this point, networking is not my forte, so uh, bear with me here. We've got our router setup instructions, and they actually look pretty straightforward. We'll start first with the modem, uh, the one that I believe Spectrum provides him. We'll power it off, and then we'll connect it to the WAN port at the back of the AXC 16000 here. So we're gonna plug one end to the back of this modem. And with the router side good to go, we're going to flip the switch here for power. Wow, check that out. I know most people don't buy routers for the RGB baked in, but this looks pretty sweet. Such pretty lights. And you can see everything has booted up now so far. We're gonna pivot over to our phone. This is my dad's phone. Uh, yes, he has an iPhone 12 screen protector over an iPhone 13 screen. 
it is what it is. So we're gonna hit setup. We have one of these routers, and now we just gotta scan the QR code on the router itself. Give me one second here. There's our QR code. Aha, uh -huh. got it. And now we've set up our Wi-Fi names and passwords. You can see our six gig network is separate. And now you'll see it is a work and it's magic. All right, and with it all set up, I'll show you we got it on top of my, uh, my dad's entertainment setup. So it's pretty high in the house, pretty much in the center of the house as well. Let's see how the coverage is in my brother's room again. So we're at pretty much the furthest room away. Gonna press go here now. And let's see how we do. Oh yeah. That is nice. Oh, you're at over 200 megs now. So this is, just so we're clear here, this is a better download speed. And the uploads are really crappy on coax. It's kind of a shame. Um, but see, so he's getting significantly better downloads with a single router than they were getting with nine different access points <laughs> before. That's how powerful this AXC uh, 16000 is. So ASUS just absolutely killed it with this product. Hey, JJ. Any OGs remember JJ? Mmm, the good days. Just for the lulls, I decided to go outside as well. You can see we're in the backyard, pretty much all the way in the back, and we're going to see what our speeds look like back here. Maybe you want to uh, mow the lawn and listen to some tunes at the same time. That's actually still pretty impressive. Look at that, almost 100 megs way out here. I am definitely not complaining. The extended range comes in super handy for these security cameras around the edge of the house as well. And here's a quick test about eh, 10 feet or so from the router in the same room that it's in. Let's see. Oh yeah, looking real healthy there. 580, 590, and of course, yeah, coax uploads. But Still pretty good. It's dark now, if you couldn't tell. We're gonna go to my sister's room now, my sister's old room, which is in the back left part of the house. Let's see how it fares there. We were getting about 200 megs down before. Let's see how we do. Oh yeah, that's looking super, super healthy. What, 250, 260? Again, it's gonna depend on who's on the network as well, and some people just showed up at the house, so more will be on it, I imagine, soon. Uh, they're also on coax, so their upload speeds are not, <laughs> they're just not great. I feel bad for folks who are still on coax, and ISPs can be super scummy. They can just drive out any competition whatsoever. You're stuck paying their prices, getting their ups and downs. It's, it's just not good. All that said, removing one more potential bottleneck from the equation by using a beefy router like this one, the AXE 16000 from ASUS, is just peace of mind. You shouldn't have to worry about uh, having any limitations, at least in the home. Now, what's coming to the home from your coax or fiber, eh, that might be shaky. But uh, at least you know you're going to be set with something like this from ASUS. Hey, Mom, I gave you better Wi-Fi. Oh, thank you. I'm so excited. I don't think I don't think she cares. <laughs> I do. You do care? I do. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, because I get cable over there from this thing. Oh, you play the games on your iPad too, right? Oh, yeah, I do. See, that matters. Upstairs. Speaking of mom's iPad, the latest Mac support Wi-Fi 6E and many Asus products also have it baked in, meaning you'll get faster speeds and more reliable connections. You can even prioritize gaming devices with this router and game packets. So if you're playing COD and you're worried about ping or you're worried about uh, just the overall experience, you don't want to lag or any of that, especially while other people are on the network, just prioritize your device, your desktop. I like this a lot. Also, shout out to these instructions. Even for a nub like me, they were super simple to follow. So yes, this thing is a beast, and I'm not gonna lie, I kinda want one for my house now. You can learn more about the ROG Rapture GT AX 16000, uh, that's a mouthful, <laughs> via the link in this video description. I wanna thank ASUS for sponsoring this video. Hopefully you guys found this at least entertaining, but I, I think it's pretty hilarious that <laughs> a beefy router like this can keep up with nine access points. Yeah, they're not the newest APs, but still, that's a lot of, of carrying to do, and this handled it no problem. Even increased speeds, not bad. With that, if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up, consider subscribing, and uh, catch you in the next one. Ooh, pantry. Food. What? Food. I found food. That means I don't have to cook? Is it time to go home now? <laughs> I guess. I'm hungry. <laughs>